really liked Camila in her new shore program, in a bright red dress. She was in a great mood, which she conveyed to all the spectators who watched this performance. She is in good promising shape, especially for the start of the season. Well done. She is mature, strong, and has an interesting program. Told by coach Irina Goncharenko. Camille of Levis starts the 2023-24 season, not knowing for sure whether she will complete it. At the end of September there is a closed meeting of the cause on the Beijing case. But this doesn't seem to affect Camille's confidence on the ice at all. She completely changed her image in the shore program, and so far this is the most daring experiment she has never tried anything like it even on the show. For the short 2023-24, Camila chose music from the erotic melodrama 365 Days I See Red, performed by the group Everybody Loves an Outlaw. Previously, she skated to modern lyrics and world classics. Bolero, Spartacus, Interstellar, music by Hans Zimmer and Kirill Richter. Tragic images were often chosen for her, and the choreography was built with emphasis on the main trump cards. Easy, quiet skating, graceful plasticity, subtle musicality. Over time, the productions began to resemble each other. It was Leva herself who came up with the idea to change her image. I would like to say thank you to the coaches who heard me and did something interesting that I didn't have. There is a combination of images here, because it's easier for me to write lyrics. And I complicate the content for myself. Now Camila is completely different. Matured, feminine and daring. She skates to sensual blues, and her choreography is not classical, but in the jazz modern style. The program begins not from the center, as in the vast majority of cases, but at the side, very close to the judges. Believe it takes a long pause and only then goes to the center. The wide, steep arcs fit well with the lead guitar melody here. Both the steps and jumps are colored with a new style. On landing, Believa playfully rolls her shoulders, stopping between steps to wink at the audience. Signature rotations and spirals are in place. At the end of the skate, Camila returns to the ice board, now facing the judges. She just accelerated so much that she tripped and almost fell on the table at which members of the Russian Figure Skating Federation were sitting. But this amused both Believa and Tatyana Tarasova and Alexander Kogan. They usually come this close to the edge of the court during exhibitions, and in competitive programs this move also looks like an element of the show. They are rarely used in the Kristalny group's programs. The costume matches the song in open red dress with a long skirt. The style is familiar to Camila, but the color is new. Previously it was used only for decoration, as in the free program under the bolero. Red adds age, but does not make it heavier. When in motion, the skirt looks like bright flashes of light against a background of snow white ice. The content is lightweight for now. Double axle, triple flip and triple lutz plus double toll loop cascade in the second half. The snap will most likely transform into a triple axle as the season progresses, so it is the first element. The cascade will become the usual 3 plus 3. Now my form is not optimal, my preparation has been disrupted by health problems. I prepared very well, I wanted to enter the season with a quadruple. But on August 16th, at a medical examination, I was told that I had a retinal tear. I had two laser coagulations, and for two, three weeks I rode carefully. I went on the ice on September 6, so I reduced the load, the skater said. There is still a month until the first starts the Grand Prix series. This time is more than enough to return stable quadruples and triple axles. But first, Believa will compete for the opportunity to speak in principle at a meeting of the Court of Arbitration for Sport. Camila answered questions and told how she had changed after the 2022 Olympics. Life consists of black and white stripes. Another question is how to overcome your obstacle courses. Do you have an answer to this question? The events that happened to me made me more aware, more mature. They turned my life upside down. Camila Valiva, 13 and 17 year old Camila Valiva are two different people. But that's how it should be. We all change as we age. And yet, I began to treat some things like an adult. Although, probably, sports helped me with this. Sport gives incredible discipline. Discipline in your actions and thoughts. Sport sets certain boundaries for you that you cannot cross, and these become your life principles. Sport is the best thing that happened to me. This is my life. A part of my life. When the sport ends, my life will of course continue, and this will remain a good main lesson for me. 
I don't know if you remember our conversation at the Olympics in Beijing, when the individual competitions ended. I came up and said that you are incredibly talented, and it's true. You looked at me and said, so God sent me these tests. It seems to me that this made you even stronger. Everything that is done is for the better. I try to stick to it. Simply because the negative is always easier to find, and the positive aspects are more difficult. And you need to learn this. This helps a lot in life. If you learn to find the positive in everything, then life will become better and more interesting. Believe and noted. There's nobody here.